uh, been going from 11 o'clock yesterday morning. It's now about two, half past two. I had uh, an hour and a half sleep at just before sunrise. Sometimes he would go away too Then one night as I closed my eyes I saw a shadow flying I really do not know what day it is I think it might be Thursday Sweetest smile Told me he wanted to talk for a while Here I am at Hulk at Hog Hill, East, East London London behind with Mike Hall who's just rode around the world and then done a few laps here with us tonight. So, Mike, it took how many days? It was, well, uh, no, we've estimated it so far at uh, 91 days and uh, 18 hours and some minutes. Uh, I was in Australia for about two weeks before I saw a live kangaroo. But I, I saw well, I saw some monkeys in India and they, they came, there was about six of them all fighting and they just stormed out between two buildings and they took me off my bike. Oh, so. right. Oh, I saw a bear in New Jersey. Yeah, it was a huge thing. It was it was in my way and I had to sort of shout to get out. I think I'd run. <laughs> but anything big, I, I get scared of cows. So I'm bloody. <laughs> it looked but... like a cow from, from far away. It was, it was um, pretty big. Just riding my bike for fun now is great. Oh, really? <laughs> so yeah. you... Well, you always kind of think, you know, I'm ready, I've done all the training and so on. But you don't, you, you haven't got 5,000 Ks in your legs right now. Um, and. Normally you won't really feel like you've got the legs until you maybe a day in and you think probably you know if you have a sleep and the first morning you get up after a sleep you'll know how good you're actually feeling because anything that hurts on day one it's, it's just like it's just settling in so um, it's always a it's kind of a little bit nervous time this sort of time because you, you're kind of thinking to yourself is it still there you know because you have to wait until you're into it so it sort of really sort of switches on. And you can't you can't do a training ride that's that's two weeks long and five thousand k long because you haven't got the time. So you never have the chance to simulate that. So you just got to have faith that it's it's all still there and it'll come. He said, Peter Pan, that's what they call me. I promise that you'll never be lonely in Checkpoint, don't get stuck. <laughs> 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 you just get on with whatever you want. All right, cool. just don't welcome me right here. And lost boys like me are free. He sprinkled me in pixie dust and told me to believe, believe in him and believe in me. Together we will fly away in a cloud of green to your beautiful destiny as we soar. I would have really brought it out in force, so not too disappointed. Uh, it was all downhill there this morning, uh, so I, I kind of might have made better miles. And there was a motel in between, which wasn't on the map, but you can never tell with these things. So I made the call. Hills here. That look like in the air look like brains, little green brains, with all the kind of um, ups and downs in between. So they're quite uh, 
they're quite kind of lumpy up and down all the time, all the time is what kind of tires you out really rather than any one long climb and one long descent. Um, bike's doing well, uh, Richard helped me fit my spare tyre and uh, I fit my chain yesterday in uh, MG it or Chevy it or however you pronounce it here. So I'll, uh, I'll leave it there and I'll catch up uh, later. Um,